Looking to make new friends while camping and enjoying the great outdoors? Well, stay tuned and we'll show you how to make that happen. We're Sherry and John, chasing our dreams and enjoying our adventure today. Because tomorrow isn't guaranteed. We are going to share what we've learned on our first camping club trip. So this weekend, we are trying something new. John and I have been camping since, what, April? Yeah, April, and now it is November. Most of our friends are really not into camping. No. Um, it's just not something that interests them, and I think a lot of them were very surprised that it even interested us. Right. We actually joined a camping group off of Facebook that's local to our area, and we are camping with them this weekend. Right. This may come as a surprise to you, but John and I are really introverts. <laughs> yes, we are. <laughs> we are not very outgoing people. I mean, I, don't get me wrong, I love being around people. Right. I I'm mean, just not, yeah. it takes me a while to open up. I'm a little bit shy and I think he is too. He's probably more shy than I am. <laughs> Tonight is the first night and our job was to bring dessert and John picked a cheesecake. Yeah. I'm hoping they like cheesecake. It looks good. It did look very good. Um, I'm sure it's very tasty. And we're going to bring the, the dessert. We skipped the appetizer part because we were setting up and we had to get the nerve up to head up there and meet everyone. <laughs> so now we're going to go meet everyone. We don't want to overwhelm them bringing our camera in the first day we meet them. So right. we're going to leave the camera here and we'll let you guys know how it went. Wish us luck. Yes. I'm so nervous. Yeah, it'll be fine. But they're not like the people who watch us. I feel really comfortable with them. I kind of feel like I know them just from like the comments and right. the interactions that we have with everyone. I really enjoy that interaction. I really enjoy when you guys give us comments. It just makes our day. We love it. And we always try to get back to you within a day. And if it takes a while, it's because we're at work. <laughs> but I love your comments because it allows us to connect with you and I feel like you know we bond with you when we get to respond to your comments. I also like the people that showed up at the uh, the show. That was that was fantastic. Well, they were that's all very thing. friendly. They're those are those friendly. are people who watch our channel that right. we connect with, right? They're, yeah. They're people we feel comfortable with uh, with because they have a shared interest with us. And they were all very friendly. Oh, the people we met at the show were fantastic and we're hoping to meet more of you at the Tampa show. But we've gotten off topic. <laughs> We're gonna grab our cheesecake. Let me show you. Oh yeah, let's see this beautiful cheesecake that oh, I picked don't drop out. It. Don't please don't drop that cheesecake. It's cracked. Uh, yeah, that's because it bends. This is our cheesecake. Look at that thing. That we're gonna take with us. It's I big. hope they like it. That's a big cheesecake. All oh, right. Well. well, let's go take our cracked cheesecake <laughs> to meet our new friends, and we'll tell you all about it when we get back. It's chilly. We're back. Here's the temperature for tonight. That's right now. It's cold out there. Oh my gosh, it's cold. I'm going to have to switch out of my jacket and put on my coat. So they had a really nice setup though, didn't they, John? They did. They had and a great setup. Lots of heaters. Yes. Uh, so inside, and they had tent set up, so it was pretty neat. It was fun. Yeah, we, we got to talk with, what, three different c couples? Yeah. And, um, yeah, we had a good time. We, we actually ended up at a table with somebody that we had some similar interests with and that, that, that was good. That was great. Yeah, so I, it wasn't, wasn't too bad on, on day one. We still haven't shared with anyone that we have a YouTube channel yet. Or, you mentioned it once. Well, Beth knows about it and she's oh, the organizer. Okay. But we didn't tell anybody else. No. You know, we don't want to. No, we just wanted to go and have fun. Yeah, like people do. Right. Yeah. You know, we'll share some more with you tomorrow. I, I think this is a good thing. I think so. So far, so good. So far, so good. So today is our second day at the campground. It's been an interesting day. We're having another potluck tonight up at the tent. So I am making a chorizo and kale soup. It basically has some uh, spicy Mexican chorizo. Garlic, onions, chicken broth, and potatoes. And I'm gonna let that all simmer in, just adding the, the kale right now. Let that simmer in. 
cook it for about another seven minutes and it'll be done and ready to share with everybody back at the big tent so it's it's been a very interesting experience can't wait to share more of the details with you guys I locked John out and it's cold outside hi John now what were you saying about me John hmm you have anything you want to say, John? What is it, like 30 degrees? <laughs> oh no, he looks, like, he looks like he's gonna cry. I better let him in. <laughs> Why? Why do you do this? <laughs> because of what you were saying to me before you went out. <laughs> you should have known the minute I asked you if you had a key that something was up. <laughs> Why do you do this to me? Don't say mean things to me. <laughs> Otherwise you get locked out in 30 degrees. I'm never mean. <laughs> I'm always nice. <laughs> so day two with our new catering <laughs> friends, John. They can drink. And they can do shot, jello shots. Jello and shots and I don't know what that liquor was that was from Europe but it was interesting. It did warm me up. Different potatoes or something. Yeah, yeah. I guess it's a type of goes vodka. Out, I don't think it was a vodka. Goes in cold, comes out hot. Goes oh, out. I felt like I was breathing very warm air after a while. Really? Just breathing it out. My whole let's throat was warm. Let's do this together. We've been outside for a few <laughs> hours now with our new friends and we were uh, a little nervous at first, right, John? Yeah, yeah. We weren't quite sure. It's, what to expect with yeah. this experiment of ours. It's hard to fit in when you don't know anyone. But you know, I must say, tonight, like, after everybody started drinking, everyone was very welcoming. <laughs> yes, they were. I mean, I, you know, and, and we didn't tell anybody. So, so part of this is that we didn't tell anybody that we had a YouTube channel. Right. Right. Because we didn't want to skew things. We didn't want people to like either feel uncomfortable, right? Because not everybody wants to be on YouTube, right? And, yeah, and I told uh, the organizer that, because she was wondering why we didn't. And I told her, I don't want anyone to feel like we're using the group to, to further our channel. Yeah, I mean, she was pretty open. She was like, why don't you bring out your cameras and why don't you film? There's another YouTuber who's way more famous than us that um, is a part of the group. And we just didn't want to, we just wanted it to be a real experience. Right. right? And, and we just, and it wasn't about the channel and it wasn't about YouTube. No. It was about us trying to find a group of people that we could camp with in the future, build up friendships with. Camping friends. Yeah, because we don't really have that. No, we don't. And so we didn't want to do anything that might make it even appear as if we were trying to do anything else right yeah so nobody so we didn't tell anybody you know yeah. and she that's, told she yeah. told people tonight a few people that were at the campfire with us but we, we kept it pretty quiet right and that's why we don't have a lot of video of the uh we don't, the have, event. Any, we don't have any right video. and that, that was intentional it was so what are your, your thoughts on um i think that if you had asked me this yesterday i would have said i don't know about this john <laughs> But I think joining a camping club is a very good way to build new friendships and build new camping friends. Also, and find out great info because we found, I took down notes for, I think, four or five different resorts that we may want to check out. Yeah, so that's another good thing about a camping club, right? Is that um, you have people who've been to lots of different resorts. But not only that, we also found out that they have, like when they camp together as a group, they get really good discounts. Like yes. We're at Jellystone, but we're not paying Jellystone prices. No, we're not. Because they, they have so many people in the group, um, she's able to negotiate prices for us, which was nice. And apparently she does that for a lot of them. And then there's lots of activities. Oh right? my gosh, yes. Like there were pretty much activities, not park activities, but camping group activities throughout the entire day. And from what we've heard in the conversations that we've had with other people, that when these outings are planned, they plan stuff for both the children and for the adults. And it keeps everybody active and involved. And 
you know, when you're doing things together, you're building those relationships together, you're learning more about camping together, so right. it's been a fantastic experience. It has been. Tonight was great. Tonight was great. Okay, it's so fun. we have one more day here. Yes. Um, that's tomorrow morning. And, and we're talking about having a breakfast together, like a breakfast cookout together, and uh, checkouts at one. So we'll see how that goes. Yes, we will. All right. After spending a few days with this camping group, I think this was a really great experience. Yeah. I think we met some really great people, too. We did. And I'm very glad we did it. Especially for the free alcohol. So yes, if you are new to RVing or if you are an experienced RVer, I think joining camping groups, I think you agree with me? I do. I think it's a great idea. So get out there, Google it, go on Facebook, look for meetups, join a camping group, have some more fun. There you go. Yeah. And don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe.